Hello everyone, thank you for joining my tutorials. Today we'll see how we can able to download the false color composite image from the Sentinel-2 dataset. Also, we can able to download the NTVI map. Then also you can able to download the NDWI or whatever the map you want to download from here, you can able to download. How to do that? For that, you just need to go to Copernicus data space ecosystem. So just go to any browser and search this. You'll get this website link. Just click here. Then you need to explore the Copernicus browser. So you will launch to this website where you need to log in yourself first. Okay. So I have already logged in here, but you need to create your account first. Okay. Once you'll create your account, then you can able to log in here. I have already logged in here. So how to create your account for that? I have already explained in the previous videos. I will share the link in the description box from here you can able to create. And first thing is that you just need to go to this visualize. Okay. And here you need to search the location for which location you want to download the data set. Let I will add here as a Mumbai. I'm interested to do it for the Mumbai. So I'll search Mumbai city. So you will see here. This is the Mumbai. Navi Mumbai. And uh, just go to selection of date here. Okay. So for which date you want to do it in the visualization. You'll be able to see this so much cloud coverage there. Okay. And uh, let I can able to click here and I will search for January. So these dates, the images are available. So I will select the cloud cover. This cloud cover is there. I'll just select the cloud cover is up to 0%. I want 0% cloud cover. Okay. And just click here, show latest data. Then it is showing me latest data also. And uh, if you want to go the back data, then you can see the back data as well. Okay. And I'm interested to download it for the 0% cloud cover. And uh, you can able to see the things here like the true color, the FCC color. Okay. If I'll click here, you will be able to see the FCC of this location. Then if you want to see the NTVI, then you just click on the NTVI, Normalized Difference Vegetation Index. So you'll be able to see the NTVI of this location. Then these are the Normalized Difference Waterborne Index. Then uh, also you can able to see the classified map of this location. Okay. So let, if you want to download this FCC or NTVI, you need to click here. The option is showing download image, download image. So just click on the download image. So you'll able to see the preview of this image, whatever we have selected. You can go to analytical. In the analytical, you can able to select the format in which format you want to download it. So I want this in a TIFF file format. Okay. Then resolution. I want high resolution. Then projection. So what projection it is coming. So this is falling 43 item zone. So I'll select the 43 item zone. Then you want to download it uh, FCC or you want to download for NTVI. So if you click on the NDVI, you will be able to see the NGPI. Okay. And if you want to download it, then you can select and you can able to download from here. Okay. Let I will download the, this FCC and NGPI. So if you want to download it, just click on the download option. Okay. Once you'll click on the download, it will start download automatically. So now file is downloaded. You can able to see the option here. So let I will go to download. You'll be able to see these options. Browser image. Just right click and extract this. Extract files. Just click on OK. So this image you can able to see this FCC and NDVI we have downloaded. If you want to download all then you can able to select all the options here. Okay. All file will download and let will open that file in ArcMap. So just copy the path. Then 
select here, just paste it in the catalog. You can open catalog from here. Okay. So just click, let I will uncheck this and you can able to see. Right click, zoom to layer. So this is NGVI and this is composite image. Okay. So you can able to see the FCC here and also you can able to see the normalized difference vegetation index. And if you want to crop it, you can able to create your study area shape file and you can crop this image and you can able to create a land use land cover mapping if you want to do. So already you are getting the band composite image for your study area. So let will create the shape file. So just right click new shape file. So let I will select a study area. I will add here as polygon, edit, then select the same UTM zone. Okay. What are the UTM zone is here? You can able to select the same UTM zone. Okay. Just click okay. Then start editing. Then create feature option is there. Just I will digitize like this. And saved it, stopped it. So suppose this is my study area. I'm interested to crop this much of my area only. Then our toolbox, when able to open our toolbox from here, then special analysis tool, then extraction and extract by mask option is there. In the extract by mask, we need to add this file that is FCC file and add the study area. You can able to save this file where you want to save. I will go by default and just click on OK. So my study area is extracted. Let will uncheck this. Okay. So what are the area we have selected? We can able to extract it. And uh, what are the band we have selected? Band one, two, three, same band is coming also here. So this way very easily we can able to download the image and we can able to crop it. So what are the image you want to download? NDWI, NDSI. So all you can able to select, you can able to download from this website. So if you're having any doubts regarding all these things, you can ask me in the comment sections. If you like this video, don't forget to like, share and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.